viewers welcome to my channel or if you're a returning person welcome back if you clicked on this video it's most likely because the subject piqued your interest am i right i do have another video on the subject i'm gonna leave a link to that video down below you guys can go ahead and watch it and then come back so that you're all filled in you're not missing anything this video is going to be very informational it's going to be better than my first basically what i'm giving you guys is my personal top tips do's and don'ts because there's some don'ts that you guys do that you need to don't and i'm going to be answering some of your guys's questions as well i'm going to pack as much information as i can into this video without overdoing it and ending up with like an hour long video so if you would like to see my fandom top tips my do's and don'ts and some q and a's at the end go ahead and keep watching the first tip i'm going to give to you guys is do a little research before you just dive on in the reason why i'm saying this is because trust me i do not mind helping you guys i want all of you beautiful women to get your bag however you guys do ask me some extremely basic like what are you even doing here questions it drives me absolutely insane. like if you have no idea what you're doing don't start like girls will literally hit me up like oh my god like i have this guy who wants to send me money like what do i say i can't tell you what to say every dom has their own style we have our own flavor we have our own experiences we have our own way of doing things that's entirely up to you you can't expect me to literally tell you what to say like that's not right myself and nobody else is going to tell you what to say that's just not gonna happen i'm just gonna give you a quick example of how we have our own different styles there's some doms who saw my last video and they got so butthurt they were so upset they were like she said all she does is post pictures and that's how she gets paid this is hard work this and that uh yeah that's all i do literally i just post pictures like, i just post like normal and go about my day and people come to me i mean sorry you don't have to work that hard but that's just not how it works for me you can't relate everybody has their own way of doing things and whatever works for you works for you throwing shade in another lane isn't gonna make yours any more sunny and just saying one of the most common questions that i get asked is if i do anything like nude or if you have to show your body and my answer to that is everybody is different nudity empowers some women get it girl modesty empowers others like everybody has their own style none of them are the right or wrong way it all has everything to do with you but for myself there's no nudity or showing my body involved the way my style is my body is for myself and for my man to enjoy subs are lower than dirt they don't deserve to see this i personally feel empowered by making stacks off of not being nude like i don't have to show anything and i still make bank that's empowering to me that makes me feel good there's no right or wrong way to do it it's all about you what you feel comfortable with your style like you have to figure that out for yourself but for me personally there's none of that involved my next tip okay you have to to be a dominant woman if you are not dominant this is not for you and that's okay you can be like a sugar baby or literally anything else but dominance is kind of the main thing with financial domination i get my way period if i want something i make it happen and that's not even in like the fandom world that's in life in general like if i want something i make it happen these tips are so important it sounds simple but i swear this is like what makes the world go around like this is the one or two this is the two if you're gonna pay attention to anything please pay attention to this because it's important be yourself and be consistent this is the number one tip that i have to give to you guys and that i tell the brand new doms when they come to me and they get salty like that's it like they act like i'm like hiding some mega golden secret and just giving cookie crumbs when like i promise you that's the best advice that i can give you being yourself is so important if you're pretending to be something that you are not other doms and subs will see right through you another tip that i have for you guys when a new potential sub is in your inbox look up their username go in the search bar look up their username see if other doms are talking about them there's been times where i searched up people's names and doms are like this guy wasted my time he ended up not paying this or whatever stupid thing that they do looking up someone's username can definitely save you from like a headache with that being said i'm gonna move on to my what not to do list number one i'm gonna start off with do not 
ask doms if they have pay pics that wouldn't mind sending you money. Especially if you've never spoken to that woman a day in your life. I can't believe I actually have to say this, but you might as well stand on a freeway with a little cup and ask for change because that's how you look. Now, if this whole section sounds like mean, I promise I'm not trying to be mean. I'm literally just trying to put you girls on because if you come into the community doing all these things and acting this way, nobody's gonna wanna help you. Like nobody's gonna wanna help get you anywhere. It's nothing but love for you guys. Like I want you guys to make it. So I'm telling you like, I'm just trying to put you on. Just listen, just listen. Number two. Do not, okay? Listen, don't. No lo haga. Promote yourself under another Dom's content. Oh my God. Like literally, it <clears throat> blows my mind that you guys even try this. It is so rude and other Dom's will not accept you. And that includes under this video. I will block you so fat. Like so many of you try to feed off of the success of others and it's disgusting. You're like, pick me up. Like, you look just as pathetic as these pay pigs out here. Don't do that. And I didn't feel the need to say for this in my first video because I didn't think people were enough to actually do it. But bait tweets. Okay. I know you're excited to get out there. You want to get recognized. You want to get noticed. But if a sub is tweeting and they're saying something like, Man, I have all this money. Who can I blow it on? But it has to be a good dom. Like somebody with a real attitude. And you guys are like, Well, I got an attitude. I graduated from Yale with my attitude degree. And everybody's like, Oh, me, me, me. Under the comments, you look thirsty. You look desperate. Other doms look at that and they're like, That is not... Okay, for the love of goddess, do not do that. You're not supposed to be convincing them why you're a good pick. They're supposed to be convincing you why they're worthy to send you their money. Next, do not message another Dom sub trying to poach him, trying to get him to send to you. First of all, they're definitely gonna go back and tell their Dom, okay? Then everybody's gonna know that you're this little backstabbing <laughs> female. You'll never catch me messaging no freaking pay pig talking about oh, oh. I want your money. Send it to me now. Get the f out of here. No. This next one. Do not steal content. That means copying and pasting or copying a tweet or whatever word for word. Don't do that. Stealing tribute photos. Corny. And I don't get it because like, yeah, you could steal my tribute photos, but whose account is the money actually in? Like that is so weird. And and back to do not copy content. I know that you guys see other women, which is totally understandable because I'm the same way. You get inspired like, yeah, like she's dope. That's bad. Like, oh, I like what she said, but don't copy her word for word. It's one thing to get inspired, but copying don't. I have had girls copy my bio word for word. In my bio, it says blonde and bitchy. They're not even blonde, but they have that in their bio. It's so annoying. I won't follow you back. I won't want to help you out i'll probably even block you for being so whack with that being said with all the ugliness out of the way if you just listen to that and do as i say you will have a smooth entrance into this world and if you've done that before like it's okay i mean it's not but it's okay just catch yourself and be like oh, okay well this isn't proper etiquette you know so try to refrain from doing those things now i'm gonna move on to the q a i do have a ton of questions but i'm gonna only answer the ones that i feel like are most relevant and that are gonna give you guys the most information are you into extreme humiliation would you do this to take some idiot's wallet well yeah duh next question is it true a lot of pay pigs and subs are like ceos and dominant in their personal life this is very true for some reason a lot of people like to say oh you're taking advantage of guys in their mom's basements and this and that that is not the case if you're living in your mom's basement you cannot serve me what good are they gonna give to you if they can't even give good to themselves there are a lot of subs actually that are they're up there but they're men of power who get tired of being in power all the time so their thing is to be submissive to be dominated and what better way to dominate somebody than to take what they work so hard for. Is fandom like a send pics and chat or does it work like OnlyFans? Typically it's through like messages or DM or something. And what platform you decide to work off of, that's completely up to you. How are you so good at it? Thank you. <laughs> the reason why I believe I'm so good at it is because it's natural to me. 
I don't have to put thought into it. I don't have to, I, I'm, it just comes natural to me. Are you okay if someone wanted you to be heartless while emptying his big wallet? Absolutely, that's the only way to do it. Are there any apps for this? Asking for a friend. As far as I know, there's no like specific like Findom app. You can literally be a financial dominatrix on any platform. That's all up to you and how you decide to go about it. I wish you guys nothing but luck and success and all the little pay piggies in the world. If you have any more questions or you want to know anything else, ask me on any of my socials. I'll be more than glad to help you guys. I want to see all of you make it and I want you guys to make money like we deserve it. Before you guys go, go ahead and like this video and hit that subscribe button for me. And yeah, I hope you guys are staying safe with COVID. Wear your mask, wash your hands, all that fun stuff.